Okay, in this video, what we're going to do is set up a Apple Mac computer to print to your Fuji Xerox device. So start off with, we're gonna download the print driver from the Fuji Film website, fujifilm.com forward slash FBAU. And we're gonna to go to support and drivers support and drivers in the middle <clears throat> uh, before we start we need to go up to the left hand corner click on the apple logo up in the left hand corner click on about this mac this box will come up and then we can see what version mac you have in my case i have high sierra which is 10.13 and so let's put the model number of the machine in i've got a 3375 here which is um an APL support mark V uh, 3375 so I'm going to click that search that and then it's found that I've got the Apple Mac OS X 10.13 um, the postscript driver is what I'm looking for because we need postscript and I'm going to download that now that's downloaded we can just double click on that That'll probably be in your downloads if it's not. Um, and so there's the the download. Double click. And yes, yes, I agree. Install. It'll ask you for your password. Whatever your logon password is. The administrator password. Enter that in. So that's just installing that print driver onto your Apple Mac computer and that's all installed successfully. So we'll close that. Oh, we don't need to keep that. Thank you. All right. Now we can just go back into your Apple logo, system preferences, and then we can select um, add a print driver. So click on the plus and it'll bring up a printer driver. Now, in a lot of cases, it'll actually auto-select. That's saying it wants to install the AirPrint. We don't want to do that. Let's just select software. Um, it's a 3376. 3376. APL support V. Postscript. We're going to go OK. And there's the driver there. And we'll add, um, now it's just setting up the device. It says configure. It'll actually find what it needs to find if you've got a, a finisher or anything else attached to the machine other than just the straight machine. It'll actually find that information. So it's added that and that'll pop up in our printers and scanners. And there it is. Now we can just double click on that. And this brings up this box here. And if we go up to the top bar, which you can't see on this video, but it'll say uh, edit printer jobs window. If you click on printer, there is a button there that says print test page. So that's now printing a test page. And we'll hear the machine. There it goes. And that's printing happily. So that's how you set up your Apple Mac print driver for your Fuji Xerox photocopier.